Now we will introduce to you the hardware of WinPack and also help you to wire the WinPack with other peripherals. Now let's see the surface of this WinPack. On the left side, this pin is pointing to the WinPack's power input. To prevent the WinPack from losing data when one power supply is unexpectedly broken, WinPack has built in dual power inputs. There is a micro SD slot on the top right part of the WinPack. The micro SD can be used for storage. Their data maximum supports up to 8 gigabytes. The upper rotary switch is used to adjust the WinPack mode of operation. There are WinPack expansion interfaces, including one VGA port, one USB port, and two RJ45 slots. The USB slot can be used to extend the peripherals like the mouse, keyboard, touch panels, and the USB hubs. We provide touch panel support for pen mount, Egalax, and Elo. The right part of the WinPack is equipped with eight slots in the video. All slots can totally be compatible with the i-8K and i-87K expansion modules. Let's go to the part of COM port introduction. On the lower left side of the outer shell is COM1. COM1 can help WinPack to communicate through RS-232. Under the main power is COM2. COM2 can help WinPack to communicate through RS-485. Above COM1 is COM3. COM3 can be used to communicate through RS-232 and RS-485. COM4 on the top right can be used to communicate with RS-232 transmission. Under the COM4 is the DIP switch. You can set your own ID here. Now we will do a demonstration so you can see the external switch mounting next to the WinPack. Connect all your equipment. One port with Ethernet, one port with the WinPack, and one port with the PC. And then we will start our demo later.